Hey guys, well, welcome to my kitchen. Today we're going to be making not one, not two, not three, not four, but five recipes using my protein drink called Power Meal from Young Living. All right, are you ready? Okay, here we go. All right guys, super duper excited today. I have been totally loving the Power Meal from Young Living, and it is a vegetarian brown rice based meal replacement. It's dairy free, and the flavor is vanilla cream. Now, I don't know about you, but I have totally tried different protein powders in my morning shakes to give me that extra boost of protein and to keep me full longer and to use as a meal replacement, and they kind of taste like ground up powdery concrete. I mean, <laughs> have you tried those and you're like, this is disgusting. Hopefully you guys know me by now and know that I'm not going to steer you wrong and I'm not going to lie to you. I'm going to share my honest opinion and uh, I really want what's best for you guys and I'm excited to share my experience with you. And so I've been trying these different protein shakes or different recipes with my protein shake and I have found five incredible recipes. So I'm going to share with you my top five with the Power Meal, and um, if you like vanilla pudding, I think you're gonna like this stuff. <laughs> I wish they put the tagline, tastes just like vanilla pudding, because I really, really like it, and um, it's full of really good ingredients. And uh, yeah, I, I love it. So, all right, let's get to it. All right, so I'm gonna put in one scoop of the protein powder, which smells like vanilla pudding. I'm going to do about a tablespoon of chia seeds. A tablespoon of peanut butter. <laughs> One banana. Okay, so what you're gonna need for the chocolate banana foster is one scoop of your power meal, uh, one frozen banana or fresh if you don't have one frozen, a cup of almond milk, uh, a teaspoon of unsweetened cacao, cacao, you know, <laughs> and one drop of my Young Living cinnamon bark. I'm just gonna put the protein powder in the bottom and then I like to add my frozen banana. cocoa powder here. And then I just like to cover it with the milk. And then I'm going to add one drop of that. Honestly, look at that. It is just like a milkshake, but it's good for you. I put some cacao nibs um, just to kind of garnish the top. I got these at Target and they're organic and um, it's just pretty. And so when your food's pretty, it just, I find it tastes better. So look at that. Doesn't that look amazing? And it tastes so good too. All right, so you're gonna add one scoop of your protein powder and half a cup of applesauce. This is going to taste like apple pie. Oh, it's so good. All right, and then we're going to add one drop of Young Living cinnamon, bark essential oil, and one cup of water. Oh my gosh, it smells like apple pie in here already. All right, and that's it. There you have it, you have an apple pie morning smoothie and it is so good and it tastes like apple pie. All right, let's get on to the next one, number four. All right, for this recipe, you're gonna need one scoop of your power meal, one cup of almond milk, a tablespoon of peanut butter, and a handful of frozen berries of your choice. Today, I'm gonna to use raspberries, but I think Blackberries or even strawberries would be super good for this recipe. All right, now we're gonna make our peanut butter and jelly smoothie. 
All right, going in first is my one scoop of the power meal. And then I'm going to add one tablespoon of peanut butter. Love this stuff. And then I'm going to add um, one handful of frozen berries. And the reason why I like frozen is it actually makes the smoothie really nice and cold, or protein shake, whatever we want to call it. And last but not least, I am just going to cover my ingredients with some almond milk. Okay, all right, I'm not gonna try all of these on camera. I feel like a, I don't know, like I'm a power meal test kitchen right now because of all the smoothies we're making. Uh, but this one, oh my gosh. Mmm, it literally smells like a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. So I just kind of sliced a little raspberry for the side because look how cute that is. Of course you can add chia seeds to any of these, although I wouldn't recommend putting chia seeds in it and then putting it in the fridge because chia seeds really swell up and then you're going to end up with one giant goop of a protein shake later when you're ready to drink it. So if you're going to add chia seeds later, I would add it right before you're going to drink it if you're going to make any of these ahead of time. All right, okay, let's try this one. It's so good, guys. It is so good. Okay, I love all these recipes. Let's try one more. Last recipe, ready? Okay. And this one, we're gonna do one scoop of our power meal. We're going to do one tablespoon of chopped pecans. We're going to do a cup of almond milk, a uh, tablespoon of chia seeds, and a teaspoon of organic maple syrup. All right, first we're going to add in one scoop of our protein powder. We're going to add one teaspoon of maple syrup. Maybe a little extra dash because it's so good. <laughs> and we're going to add one tablespoon of pecans and one tablespoon of chia seeds. All right, last but not least, we are going to cover our ingredients with some almond milk, and now we're just gonna blend it all up. Honestly, what this one reminds me of is the pecan pancakes my mom always gets when we go to restaurants, and so it smells like maple syrup, you can taste it. Of course, you can add ice to any of these to make them a little bit thicker and a lot colder. Alright guys, well that's my five recipes for uh, using your power meal to make shakes. Now I cannot take credit for all these recipes, I think I've Googled and Pinterest and found all kinds of different combinations and then tried them out and so I've tried them all before now and really really enjoyed them so I want to make sure you guys had a chance to see what I'm doing with my protein meal or power meal for my protein shake in the morning. All right, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, if you did like it, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not subscribed. But what I wanna hear is how do you make your protein shake in the morning? Do you use Young, young Living? Does yours taste like concrete? <laughs> if you're looking for one that tastes like vanilla pudding, make sure you message me or send me um, a note and I will definitely hook you up. So thanks so much for watching, guys. I will see you next time. Bye.